So what do we do if we want to add uh, two measurements with uncertainties? For example, I had a measurement of five centimeters plus minus one, like a stick of this length could have been here, could have been here. And I want to add another measurement of six centimeters plus minus two. So another stick that could have been shorter or could have been longer. If you think you're adding the sticks one to another, it's clear that the uncertainties, they add up. Because now, instead of only uncertain like this, you could be worst case, be uncertain of this, plus the other uncertainty. So what do we do? We add the absolute uncertainties. So what does this mean in this case? I'm taking my five centimeters, I add the six centimeters, I get 11, so I take the best case scenario, and then I take the 1 centimeters plus the 2 centimeters gives me 3 centimeters. And that's it. So simply add the absolute uncertainties. If you're multiplying or divide values uh, with uncertainties, we use another rule. Uh, remember when we added and subtracted them, we added the absolute uncertainties. For multiplying, this won't work. Thinking, for example, if I have a, a, a long room of a length of 100 meters uh, plus minus 10 meters and a width of 10 meters plus minus 2, and I want to figure out, okay, what's the surface area uh, of this room, I will have to multiply these two values. So in this case, what we do is we add the relative uncertainties, relative uncertainties. So this is actually why we have relative uncertainties. So first step, if you do this, you have to transform your absolute uncertainties in relative ones. So 10 meters plus minus 2 divided by 10 times 100% gives me 20%. And 100 plus minus 10 meters gives me 100 meter plus minus 10 percent. Now what I do for the value itself, I simply multiply my 10 meters with the 100 meters. So I have 10 meters times 100 meters. And then how much could I be off? I'm adding the percentage values. So 20 percent plus 10 percent. So what I get is 100 is 1,000 square meter plus minus a total uncertainty of 30%. Now, if I wanted to convert this back into absolute, I can. So this means 1,000 square meters, 30% of 1,000 is... 300. So I could give this as the final answer. So if you have to multiply or divide certain things with uncertainties, add the relative uncertainties. If you want to add and subtract, you add the absolute uncertainty.